yo 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 what's up what's up what's up na 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 we have uh scw 44 uh not finals um tournament this is momo and adler and this is game number one so these guys, this is in the quarterfinals, I want to say. And winner of this series plays JH or Alex. Um, so Momo is also known as Vulture. And let me just slow this down. And I want to see... I got to see exactly who... Adler is. Sorry, there won't be a little bit of sound for a few seconds. Potato. I feel like I don't know who. I feel like I don't know who Adler is. So we will get to see a. I don't think I've done any of his games. Gonna put a bunker down. He's gonna be tearing. And. Yeah, people been call a couple people call me out on my clicking. I guess I click a little bit too much. Sometimes I have a little bit too much caffeine get me through the work day. And uh, yeah. So we got four five marines. And gonna defend this pretty nicely. Gonna start building some cannons right here. Get rid of the choke. For Adler, gonna pull the SCVs, and this is good to, to keep these SCVs here. They help kind of get in the way of the Zealots. So these cannons should be finishing up. Gonna build another bunker up here. I like this move. He's got Academy on the way, and this cannon gonna be finishing up any second now. Got the first gas coming down. And usually you want to get that cyber. Yeah, so he's Momo. And Momo is a very, very good player. He's taking games off of the Koreans, uh, Hydra, um, all the all the good West players. I do want to see, here's a good little attack right here too as well. I do, this, good, this bunker doing good protection. Um, I do want to see what rank. Let's also go off for a little second. I do want to see what rank Vulture ended up. So he came in second for this season. Doing a good job over here trying to attack this academy. Going into range. We get some SCVs right here. That's already 2 3. And gonna have to stack attack. Going back over here after the academy. Just going back and forth, back and forth. Another SCB gonna come down. Nice job getting the command center. And he is gonna defend this. He should get a factory pretty soon. Range is gonna be, ooh, it's taking a little bit longer than I thought. And we are gonna see what does Momo Vulture go into. I think he's going in here to scout a little bit. Oh, this guy gonna sneak in as well. Here's your fact. Your engineering bay. Two SCVs going down, so 24 17. And guys, I'm excited to do some other players that are not really on my channel. If you guys have good games, always feel free to send them to me. Um, sometimes I, I do kind of forget, so you can just remind me. Um, but yeah, if you guys want to ask, ask in the comments what my email address is, and then I'll, I'll just I'll comment what it is, and you guys can just send me replays. Because if you, if the game if you know the game is good. Go ahead and send it to me. Um, I don't. I don't watch any of the games beforehand. I like that Adler going for the 
factory and then a starport. So we'll see if he tries to go into a a tank drop. So here's your triple nexus. Got the Templar archives already. Gonna lift this up. Go we'll try to get some information. Did he scout? He did not, but he scouted that mid build. So gonna go right into probably. Let's, he should get siege first. Gonna lift this up. And Zealot coming in here, gonna scout. Adler needs to get two more gas right now. He needs to have already a second gas. And it doesn't look like he's that fast of a player, but as you guys know, you don't need to be playing super fast. Um, you can play 130 to 150, and you can beat a lot of good players. So that's going to go down. He's going to see all these cannons up here. Is that a DT already? I think that's a DT I thought I saw. Yeah, DTs are in here. So this is going to be... He's got the turret right here, but... Might be able to just take out that turret. Let's see if he's going into a drop. There's your shuttle. And... Zolot's still getting made. I think... Um, Here's your DT's coming in. Going to take this out. He's probably going to get some... He does have a scan. I think he's going to get some SCVs. He's at 27. Just take, start taking out these SCVs. Oh, smart move. Going to go after... There's your scan. Going after the... Com set. Bringing these guys back. And... Just some... Random information for you guys. I am going to Tampa this weekend. I don't know if any of you guys live out there, but I will be out in Tampa. Um, leave a comment and I'll be at the beaches uh, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Partying it up. Kind of partying it up. I mean, yeah, I'll be partying. Uh, I don't like to say that I'll be partying on here because I don't know. Work people or anything like that see this stuff. But I do deserve to have a nice little time I work like crazy so yeah you might see a little tank drop action 8 minutes 24 seconds in and I know in this series we get to see a Protoss vs Protoss I love seeing Protoss vs Protoss a lot of cannons it's almost a little excessive you want to have about 3 so actually it's it's pretty good uh, you want to have about 3 and 3 Here's your drop over here. That tank drop's coming in. This is your Templar drop. Yeah, there's no way this is going to make it through. Siege. Oh, that was close. And if you guys like my channel, subscribe. This guy's just chilling. Let's see what... He's in hold position. He's going to... Can he see him? Here's that. Well, now he's just going to start killing. I don't think he knows he's here. He, he didn't know he was here. And gonna go with a double drop. This is what Momo is. He's good. Oh, that guy's not gonna drop right there. He's gonna see these. This guy's got 10 kills. Uh, 8. 13. Excellently attacking this bunker. But that guy eventually gonna go down. And Momo, in my opinion, very, very, very good Protoss versus any matchup I think I would take his Protoss I mean his Protoss can be top top of the line against any Western player even even Hydra all those players so he's trying to sneak this guy through and this tank he's trying to snipe he's gonna get the storm off and wow got about 23 or so kills And yeah, I am not. I'm gonna put um, D and I, I did not put D and D out. I don't think. I don't know how to turn it off, but yeah, I don't think I have D and D on. So, uh, Lucas told me that J H and Alex are playing right now. So, I'm gonna do as many games of a part one for this, and then I'm gonna do that, and I'll do the part two. Um, and so these games will get posted over the weekend. Maybe I'll post. Ooh, maybe I'll post this one tonight. I'll move. I gotta, I gotta move back my the other games. 
Doing a nice job. Adler Adler is doing a pretty good job. If he didn't lose those SCVs right here. And he's in a mid spot, so it's just easy to drop. But this is going to be another... I'm sure there's some Templars in here. Yeah, two Templars. Going to get all the SCVs down to 17. I think that's going to be your game. But I do want to move these... My games that I already have posted and look at this gets a lot of gateways he's ready to just go for a frontal attack there are some bunkers up here but maybe get a couple archons or so he forgot to get speed though where is does he know about it he does not know about it oh he got it. okay it's just it literally just went through so let's see what is today Okay, I'll move all these Gensei ones back. Here's your frontal attack. Got the drop coming down here. Pretty nice little dodge. But look at this, just way too much. Let's see if he has any upgrades. One, 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 another storm, and super trash is what Adler, I don't know if he's talking about himself or if he's talking about Momo, don't know if these guys like each other or not, I do think that Vulture, the one thing I really like about Vulture, and I gotta look and see if Adler plays a, a lot of the uh, good players as well but I like that Vulture plays all the Koreans um, I don't know if it was him it's either him or Alex beat JH this season with a ZVP okay Adler talking about himself so I think these guys are friends the way they're, they're talking to each other it seems like which I I I think that, yeah, um, I think that more players on the West scene should be more friendly to each other. There's, just, there's a lot of trash talk that goes on, a lot of low negativity, you know, and uh, I mean, it stems from competition and being competitive, but Yeah, I like seeing people be friends and, and chill, you know. I'm just a chill broski. I like to see chill broskis as well. Okay, 13. So I am moving these around. We got a PVZ. Oh, we're going to go into the triple. I like it from Adler. So Overlord coming in. And this is going to give Momo a lot of time to just say, hey, I'll get maybe two Sunkins up here. He doesn't even see a gateway that's done. So, yeah, not even going to make this into a Sunken. He's probably going to go four, maybe five hatcheries. He should go one more hatchery right now. Going to get that Sunken just in case maybe there's a Zealot up here or something like that. He's going with the Expo already. Or is he trying to... Yeah, he's going to go with the Expo for his Minerals. Which, ah, I don't know if that's the best idea, but... If you're planning on... If you think you're going to be able to defend early... Or, not defend early, but are you going to be able to survive... The first 12 minutes. So let's see. We got Robotics Citadel. Two cannons up here. Got the one gateway. I think he should have went into a Stargate. Just so he could see what is he up against. And look, if he went for a Stargate, he could be killing some overlords left and right. 
Um, and that is one thing that I really think. And then you also get this scout off. So here's your Hydro then going to come down. But he would have a Corsair out on the uh, ma getting made right now. And he'd be out in the map in maybe 10 or so seconds. He'd kill this over. Actually, I would send over here. I'd save this overlord because you know you can kill that overlord. So I'd save that. I think he does see it. Um, kill as many overlords. You'll get about two Corsairs. You'll probably kill one, maybe two overlords. And then you'll get this third one. And then you can scout for any other ones. This one would probably go down. And, I mean, he could get four overlord kills. So, so he's got this drone chilling over here. He's got six hatcheries. Gonna start making some hydras, I'm guessing. Yeah, he's got hydra right here. Getting speed. Larry's halfway done. Templar archives. Here's your stargate. And gonna get a gateway up here. A couple more cannons. Because I mean if you're if you're worried about getting attacked by hydras early on or zerglings, just get a couple more cannons instead of you don't need another gateway to pump out zealots to defend up here. So here's your expo. Corsair. And now he's going to be able to take out this overlord. Probe count 55, 45 drones. And I was just watching a cast that RJB did. And he his theory... On Zerg is to get 48 drones for on your minerals, and then he says 30 for gas. Um, I would think you need a little bit more, but I never really played Zerg too much. I think you would need maybe 52 drones on minerals, and then maybe 33 to 36 on gas. You want to get all all your gas. There's 12 interceptors and then 3 on, on gas, so 36 drones. So it's been kind of a little bit of a quiet game. I think Adler's doing pretty good though. He's, he's going to have the drops coming. He could maybe do a drop right here and then a drop right here. And spores are coming down. I would also send those Corsairs over here. Make sure there's nothing over here. You went for that triple, so I would also get an observer. I think he's going to really just use all of his shuttles. I think he should split these up, in my opinion. Do a drop down here to here, and then a drop from here to here. And look at all of these sunkens right here. So, no way this is going to get busted through. A lot of players will just drop a bunch of Reavers right here, Corsairs, and try to just start attacking. Instead of going all the way through, here's your drop. There's Wulcha. That's Alex. Two Templars in here. Storm. Really good storms right there. Did he pick up that Templar? He's going to act like it's not in there. He's going to pull it out. Oh, he's going to... Oh, nice! Down to 37 drones. Adler. Very, very little tricky. He's, and he saved his shuttles. I see so many players not save their shuttles. There's your expo. This is a nightmare to to get through. There's another drop. Eight minutes, thirty seconds in. I mean, Adler's, his Protoss almost looks, I hate to say it, but better than like Hydra's. And, I mean, you got, this is how you got to play. Get these big drops. I mean, that's a bad storm, but I feel like whenever I watch Hydra play his Protoss, his drops are so late. And he doesn't go with enough shuttles. So. I think Adler is doing a pretty decent job. 
And look at these, he's got all of this right here. So I mean, get a couple Reavers and just start pushing at the front. He's gonna go for this attack and see all of these Sunkins right here, which he's not gonna get anything done. Another drop coming through, but that's when you know, get a couple Reavers. There's your Templar Storm. Nicely done, down to 39 drones. I think he probably has one. Okay, he does not have a Templar in there. And look at that attack, just lost one Sunkin. So he needs to go all Dragoons, but also get a couple more Robotics here. There's your Expo, upgrades 1-1-1. But he will slowly get some of these killed. And I mean, look at this, he's just all Drones is what uh, Momo is. So he's gonna get this one, I think. And he might be better off just put, pulling these guys back a little bit, taking out, taking out this this hatchery. I'll have another drop coming soon because you don't want him to rebuild. Kind of want to have some Dragoons here chilling. Here's another big drop coming through. That one going to not make it through. But you do want to kind of have a couple Dragoons right here so we can't rebuild these Sunkins. So just put those three or four Dragoons right here in hold position. And then also kill this. So now 58 Drones starting to get his economy back. Another attack, and he might even start being on 2 2 2. Not yet. And Momo doing a good job with his Scourges. And I think he's Momo's got a good going down here. Look at this, cleaning this out. Momo's got a good Zerg. So don't underestimate him playing against players in the future, the Koreans. But he's getting dropped pretty hard. Scorgies, he should have went right here and let him just hold. There's your storm. On the 55 drones. The hatchery did go down. He needs to, Adler needs to put Put two robotics right here. Oh, he's got some robotics. Oh, he's okay. Doing what he needs to do here. So get some reavers and just start pushing with those reavers. Queen right here. Gonna put down some more sunkins. Now Momo has a good amount of minerals now. 2600. So take some of these guys off and start making some gas. Storm came down, I think. Reaver right here. Look at this, Reaver gonna get some good shots. Can let these Dragoons be able to kill that Sunken. I think he's gonna bring a drop down here and try to go this way. If I had to bet, that's the way I think he he will go. I mean, even having one a one shuttle come this way would be pretty good. The Reaver went down. He's gonna go back up here. Start getting as many spore colonies. Let's see if he's got two, 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 one, two. Here comes that drop. <clears throat> we he missed it. This might get through. Templars. There it is. One storm, two storms, all the way down to 34 drones. Let's see what the upgrades are for Momo. He's got two, two. Some probes over here. Looks like he maybe either gonna build some stuff or he's just getting rid of these guys sending them more sunkins coming down do have the expo right here and this is this is what I was talking about if Momo can get into the long game this, this expo is gonna save him uh, but this he's gonna might get scouted out with it 
Well, that's gonna go down. I don't see any lurkers. And I'm guessing Adler is wondering why why is he able to make all these sunkins? And he is gonna spot this out. There's your reavers. He might even say something. You can see him. Oh, you have a expo. He should have known. We'll see when he realizes it. But getting these reavers up here is doing a pretty good job. He better have the upgrade for attack. Does okay. There's another drop. Look at all of these hydras and. Unfortunately, not going to be able to get that one through. That's why I think he should come down here with a couple shuttles. Easily sneak in a drop. I think he's going to do that next just because there were so many Hydras up here. Look at all these Hydras. Momo's going to be ready to go for an attack. He needs to get some Zerglings to kill these Reavers though. Get some more hatcheries coming down. Might even be 3-3 three, three now. 2-2. Two, 2-1-2. Two. Two, two. Yep, gonna just build some cannons over here. Sunken's coming down though. So the Sunken's will take care of that, so that's not gonna go down. The Templars right here he is getting in here with these Reavers. So Adler, let's watch this little battle that's gonna happen. And we're going to have to see some mutas. I don't see... There's, oh, he does have a greater spire. Wouldn't it be great if... See, what, what Momo could do right now is if he upgraded... Um, he should have just upgraded Overlord speed. Or I think he probably has Overlord speed, but then being able to transport, you can just drop a bunch of hundred uh, Hydras in here and... That's going to be your game. So Momo could have taken this game already pretty pretty easily just with that. So there's your attack over here. He doesn't have speed. Yeah, he... And that's one thing that <clears throat> a lot of the Western players don't do. And they, they just don't realize. They just don't think about it because they're just not used to it. Nice stone coming down. Nice dodge. 47 drones. These guys all went down or are going down. Another storm. Dragoons are just going to keep coming. He's got to have two. Yeah, three, two, three. Beers pushing in. Gotta, gotta get some some zerglings in here for some probes, storms. Take out these reavers, but would have been a lot less damage. Comes a storm. Gonna try to snipe it out. Drops. There's your templar pulling the drones and gonna go down. I, I would just take these guys out and go straight for the attack. With those lurkers, start sending. He's got hydras. He's got a bunch of units. Gonna just have to kill these reavers up here. But he's gonna pull back. Momo, you gotta get speed on your overlords, bro. You gotta get that transportation. Three three upgrades, nice smoke coming down. I'm gonna try to rebuild some sunkins. guys back he did kill some of his probes Your 
next drop. Just pulling those lurkers up. Gonna green stuff it. And he got the right shuttle. One out of four. 25% chance. So, I think so. Doing a lot of good pressure up here. Pull that observer up. These guys are all getting smoked. Let me know what you guys think of new players. Um, SCW games like this. I mean, I'd love casting casting uh, tournament games. Where's that observer? Bring it back. Drop probably getting. I guess it's not. He still has not dropped from bottom to top. Look at all these suckins. And if I was Adler, I would get three more robotics here and then start building some gateways in the middle. Maybe even try to drop some Reavers over here. Should also be trying to get an Arbiter. Many hydras. Here's our drop coming in, and the reason I say that is because zerglings are no gas, and they definitely help against this reaver attack. Would be good. Some zerglings, but those guys get absolutely smoked. But yeah, they just help a lot. So we got six, twelve hatcheries. Everybody should be maxed out on their upgrades. See what it feels like for Momo right here. Feels a little. He doesn't have much defense up here, so if a drop comes through, could be in some trouble. Gonna take all of that out. Might be able to start selling. We have not seen a defiler either. So a couple swarms would be pretty pretty good here too. So to pull these guys back, he doesn't want to get dropped again. He just has these six gas, and he should definitely be getting more gas as well. I don't even think he has three on this one. Nothing on this one. Barely any on these. So, here's your drop. Finally going to come from bottom. Bottom mid. So, let's see if Momo... He's been paying attention up here, this drop. He's pulling these guys. Look at how easily this drop gets in there. Storm. And this guy got a drop. Oh, Put a storm there. Close. 44 drones now. And yeah, I would keep keep trying to drop over here. Reavers doing some work. Need some Zerglings in here. Look at this. These Reavers are killing it. Look at all these guys. I mean, that was... 12 hydras right there from just those two reavers. 118 supply. Adler continuing to stay maxed out. Just keeps making the dragoons, which is what he needs to be doing. But he should have two more robotics here. And I am being. I, I critique just because. Hey, if, if these guys watch it. They can have better understanding. Maybe some things they can switch up. You know, it's and it's a lot easier to look at something and say what that person needs to do better versus actually doing it. 
That's why if you get a coach next to you, easy peasy. There's another drop. Ooh, is one gonna get through? Not gonna get through. So, there's a lot of units though. But he rebuilt these sunkets pretty nicely. Both Adler and Momo have good pro tosses. I feel like. Um, I do think that Mo uh, Adler. A few things he could be doing better. Very minor though. Just where he's dropping from. Building a few more things. And. Yeah what he's doing now is. Is working. Yeah it looks like he's going to continue to drop from that bottom. I wouldn't mind seeing him drop. Some stuff right here though. Some reavers. Take out those spores. But yeah, doing a good, good job. There's some zerglings. There is some zerglings. Here comes that drop though. And storm. Oh, he had such a perfect storm right. He was just about to. That could maybe have ended it. Really close. That's an 80% end the game. Could have been close. This is a big drop. I mean, how many robotics facilities? One, two, three, four. Yeah. This one here it comes. Some zerglings. He's trying to pull the hydras back. And that's another thing is Momo needs to be able to. He's not really dodging this. Is there another Templar in here? Only one storm. Now yeah, they're slowly getting in here. That could have been way worse. Now I would try to sneak one over here. Just got to kind of continuously switch things up. Got a couple lurkers right here. 71 drones, 73 probes. No defiler mount. I had to bet. I'm going to say that Adler's going to win this one. This continu uh, continuous just pressure right here. And this frontal attack has been really doing a lot. Momo, if he gets dropped once, he's going to be dead. I mean, that Reaver, killed, Reaver just got four kills right there. Three kills right there. I mean, if they just land in the right spot they'll get with that I and mean, that's three kills right there so just having a couple zerglings there we go some zerglings right here next drop I have a feeling I guess he's bringing it down here he's gonna bring it down he did build some more robotics okay just took him some time it's like everything I tell him it's taking him a little bit of time to to think of what he needs to do, and then he he does go for it though. But I guess this is the the better drop. Maybe not. He did move these hydras back down. Here it comes storms. It's a lot of reavers. Drop coming in. Pulling the drones and not going to get the storm off. He should have about four Templars in here. Oh, he's got an extra one stuck in here. There he drops it and drop the Templar. Oh, we wanted to see him move. There it goes. Nicely done by Adler. And now he's got 12k. Get rid of some of your probes. 
That was very, very nicely done by Edler. I think he can get rid of some of his probes right now, though. And his, for his next drop, go for a nice big attack right here. Make him pull all the Hydras. Then maybe drop over here. Maybe not. I mean, it, the drop down here has been working, so. He's doing a good job with his storms as well. This one. Is he going to go over the top? He's got. There's your Templars. I do find bringing a Reaver in with your drop is. Not bad either. Yeah, he's going to bring this one right here, so. Do think he needs to go with a big attack first? Let that big attack happen. Looks like he's gonna go a little bit premature. And this is gonna be your shuttle with the Templars. Storm. And he's got this guy chilling in here. Which one is it? Storm coming down. Or is this one? Another storm. And he must have upgraded Templar. Let's see if he's got 250 on here. Yeah. So Adler getting all the upgrades that you need to. Get some nice storm action. Really, really doing a lot of the things that he needs to do here. Momo gonna call the GG, so Adler, very, very nicely done with that. Did a lot of things that he needed to do. So game number three, score gonna be one to one. We're gonna see a Protoss versus Protoss. I think this will be the last one I do of this part. I think. Yeah, he needed guardians. I think. I think he just needed to go for a little drop right here. I mean, just a nice hydra drop. A couple lurkers, get some probes. So we're going to see Adler top right. Momo, bottom left. I think Adler, Adler played, played good. We're gonna see Nexus. Nexus. There's your choke. Choke. Yeah, these guys are cool. They are characters. Adler likes to go with the triple nexus, which I do not oppose. So he's going to see the choke, and we'll see if that makes Momo go into another nexus. He's got the double gas. Don't think so. He's got this probe out here. I wonder if he's going to put a nexus right here, but... He is going to have faster drops. Triple gas for Adler. Sometimes even getting a four gas because you have the third extra Nexus. Cannon. And one little strategy that I used to do against players. Maybe, maybe someone will, will use it in the future. In a Protoss versus Protoss. You do this. A lot of players will never expect you to just go with 
a reaver push and go with a mass because they think you're probably going drops too so you get some dragoons try to stop some drops but you cannon right here in the middle and you can also get a couple reavers and you just start pushing because your opponent is not going to have many gateways not many units so let's just see how fast he's going with dragoon range so maybe that'd be interesting if that's what he actually went for but there's your robotics I mean, he, he would have had one robotics right here where he could let's see when he could start making that that's gonna get spotted out when could he start making some reavers and look at he's just completely boxing in Adler which I I like you're gonna know where the drops are coming have a couple of dragoons here Maybe even make a couple pylons right here. A couple pylons right here. Help with drops. Koreans, I feel like they, when they play protest versus protest, they, they rely too much on the one shuttle drop. So, I mean, I think what Momo's doing here, possibly good strategy against Koreans and right now I think it's a good strategy against Adler as well it's like he's going for a the one thing I like about Adler is he goes for here's a Corsair scouting things out he goes for more units drops so or more shuttle drops he uses more shuttles than just one or two so he most likely gets it in there that's what she said. Um, Nexus, I like that from Momo. Just in case he does get dropped, it's gonna help. I wanna spread these guys out. More gateways coming down. Reavers would just be, would just bash through this. You would have to get an observer. Oh, he already has one. There's a DT up here. Yep, so here's your cannons on the side. Observer. Are we still pumping Dragoons? I was wrong. Probe count 65, 57. Observer going in, getting a little scouty scout. Scouty McGee's. a drop I didn't see it and yep I mean if it was in the shuttle he would have gotten he was already pulling his probes but he would have got a, a storm off but now think about it you got three or four reavers right here you just start pushing maybe six reavers just get pushed pretty quickly got the observer you got some dragoons and might be game over. I think the Reavers would have came a little bit faster too. More cannons coming down. Almost gonna have to try to start dropping pretty soon though. Just getting some robotics to Stargate. There's your shuttle.
Yeah, look at all those shuttles right there. Nice big drop. These guys are kind of going to just see this. I think he might have... Did he see that with the Observer, possibly? Kind of knew that was coming. And look at Adler. I like it. He's going to go all the way over here. Hopefully this Dragoon doesn't spot it out. He's going right over the top. And what a good move. Ooh, that one's going to get sniped. Oh, I had a chance. Did he get this uh, storm off? I thought it was a storm by Loma. I do think he should have went all the way over here. Brought it or brought it right here to here. Obviously, he doesn't have vision, so he doesn't really know. And we'll see where this drop comes from. Now, the thing about Adler is he doesn't have any place to pull his probes to. So he should he should have tried to get an observer out right here. Because when this drop comes through, he's just gonna be able to stack and move his his probes. So here comes your drop. He's not gonna be able to pull him to a different mineral patch. He's not even seeing it. What? Missing the drop, did he forget to get storm? Oh man. That is huge. Adler could start going for the attack. I'd start just pushing out right now. He's got built some more gateways. Start going for the attack. Put a little pressure on your opponent. He's got all these shuttles. Bring that shuttle over here. Go for the attack. Let's see what the upgrades are. Zero, zero, 001, here's a drop right here. Now this one, going to get through. There's a, Arbiters. Nowhere to pull the probes. Get this, he's just gotta dodge like that. And a terrible storm right there by Momo. Let's see what Momo's upgrades are. One, one, one. Storm's coming down. Looks like we might have another drop right here. But I think Adler's going to have a pretty big drop pretty soon. He's also got an Arbiter. There it is. Oh, this could be a huge reaver drop if he really wanted it to be. Oh, he lost all his probes. I missed it. And he still doesn't know that he lost his probes. Uh-oh. That is not good. And he's focusing on this drop right here. So he is... There we go. He's going to move the probes. I did not see it. Here comes the drop already pulling the probes. He's got the bait one in the back. I like it. Storm right here. Going to get a lot of probes in the probe count. Equal. Well, these guys are both equal, but Momo's got 3k and 2k. You realize he didn't lose the, all those probes right there? There's another drop. There we go. See what the upgrades are. One one two. One one one. Adler doesn't like Protoss versus Protoss. Can't let your opponent just build outside your base like this though. And being across map. Here, 
comes. Let's see if he stays this. He doesn't have it. Not really seeing it. One storm. Down to 33 probes. I'm almost going to be able to start getting maxed out here. Start going for this frontal attack. Couple of reavers up here. Corsair kind of sneaking out. So I can maybe put it right here and be able to move his probes in the future. More cannons coming down. And yeah, supply 179. 188, 180. When is it time to attack? Some more cannons gonna come down back here. I think Momo should just make a few robotics right here and just try to drop up here. Good job of getting a couple extra Nexuses, Adler. He's got the arbs, hockey in his probes. Here comes a little attack action. One, one, two, 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 two. So both players are pretty even. The only thing is Momo is controlling the map. And it makes it extremely hard to stop drops or to, to drop your opponent. Try to storm these reavers. One thing that Momo doesn't have going for him is he just doesn't have that many gateways. So I want to see. Oh, I missed another storm. Sorry, guys. Are we stasis. We'll see if, if he has his hotkey. He has a chance. Three, two, one, go. Ah, two, one, go. Oh, he did get a storm off. I think maybe, it, did it already have the action? I don't know. I don't know why these guys are going all the way over here for their, their minerals. I rebuild the cannons. This is why the Koreans use the one cannon rule at the front, because this is what happens in a Protoss vs. Protoss. It gets very elongated. in here it's got a lot of cannons right here he does have the arbiter so he, he can stasis he's got two arms back here here it comes and he moves the arm storm templar he gets that templar and not gonna get any kills We'll see if Adler starts maybe moving out. Got a 
Got some reaver action. Let's see if this guy is somehow ready to storm. so many cannons oh this guy got the storm off so he how did that happen how the heck did that happen I need to see that again another drop coming in I don't know if this one's gonna make it through Templar storm gonna get more probes all the way down to 10 I need to see how that happened. So Momo with some good storm action, all the way down to 14, get 11 probes. Good thing that other has going. Yeah, he's like, where did that storm come from? That's what makes, I mean, you watch the Korean players, they see storms all the time, it's crazy. Stasis is gonna come down. Possibly. Like, I don't know if that Templar dropped and then automatic. It just like seemed like it dropped and automatically stormed. I don't know if there's some way to do that. And if you know how to do something like that, let me know. That's crazy. Got the Reavers up here. He needs to try to storm these Reavers up here. He needs to get some Templars. He's gonna put some of his own Reavers up here. That's a good counter. Got the upgrade on attack. And he's probably gonna try to maybe sneak a drop right through here. So there's a good storm right there. Taking out all those reavers. And Adler just going to call it. So, I mean, it wasn't completely over, but he is just going to call it. So that's going to be part one. Scored to me two to one. Momo up. Good, good games. Give it a like, subscribe. Oh, let me, let's go check this out. I think it was right at 20. Okay. Did it happen already? Oh, it happened already. Let's go back. Okay, let's watch this. This a Templar drops out of here. Watch this guy storm. I'm pretty sure it's this guy that storms. I guess he had time. I, I guess he had, he had enough time to. One more time. He had enough time to storm there. I guess he clicked it and let's see if I if I could do it. I don't know, that's hard. Let me know what you guys think. That's crazy. So, something, I mean, I've never seen that. So, good stuff. Give it a like, subscribe, and I'll be doing part two. Um, and, yeah. Talk to you guys there. PDC.